All right, so back on hardcore. We have four and a, pretty much five levels to go until max traders. I still haven't got those two ram sticks for this. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do some interchange first. We've got um, decontamination service we can do at the same time and chumming. And chumming. So we can get the nighttime kills. We get these nighttime kills that leads into a heap of easy tasks too. So let's see what dailies we've got. Woods, three survives. I don't really, don't really need to do much in woods. Eliminate an EPMC with a headshot from more than 50 meters. Righto. You're a jerk. I would like to get this day, uh, this weekly done, but we need more vases. Some insulating tape and corrugated hoses. We actually have this. And this is two Jaeger rep. Bam. Cool. I think I might redo the woods one. I just don't think we have anything to do in woods. It just costs us a little bit of money. Can of thermite and a TNT brick. And more Jaeger rep. Bam. Easy dubs. All right, that was easy. Yeah, mule reward for samples is nice and all, but like, no. Nah. Oh yeah, it's, it's actually it's on a, uh, a fence task anyway. So, all right, um, we can get those couple of guns for us. Guns, lots of guns. All right, so we do have this rig, and it's actually not a bad rig for interchange. Have we dropped off the hat, the uh, helmets? No. Well, let's take a helmet in. And then for guns, I think we still need to get a scav kill on. We still need scav kill, so I'll hold on to the 12 gauge for that. So maybe I'll just go, maybe I'll just take the SVT. I think I've got spare mags for it here somewhere too. The meds. I don't have any heavy bleeds. Four and five. All right. And then respirator. Cool. Any change was not nice to us the other day. So hopefully that changes. Let's just quickly go over everything. Make sure we don't forget anything. So we've got, we need to get into Emicon. Stims, obviously. We need the RAM. Emicon, RAM, fuel conditioner. We need bronze lions. Chumming. So if we can find gold chains in generic, we can hand them over. And then interchange pot delivery so we've got the helmet we can place down we have to survive five more times we have to kill scavs and we also have to pick up the books all right but the main focus is to get those two two uh ram sticks so it's actually a really good time to, to go into a raid there are two gold chains in the lockers in goshen yesterday yeah there's gold chains in the lockers there's also gold chains that spawn in um uh generic itself so you, on the bed so you can literally pick them up and just walk straight across because I'm just trying to get it to, I'm trying to pretty much get to max traders. So then I can just do it, take a break from hardcore. And it might be the end of the end of the season. Or it might just be like intermission of streaming it until it catches up. And then we'll go for Kappa. But at, I really do want to try and work on filming a heap of guides. I've got some fun ideas planned. Like all that kind of stuff. So... open somewhere oh this is good this is a good spawn cpu we didn't bring any cash in though on oh, the cars up too man So, RAM is really the main thing we're after. Do you guys remember what else I need? I mean, I've had two days off. Now, I've already forgotten everything. Three, actually. I played with Aqua for a day.
Best hardcore season yet. I'm glad. Frozen with a 52 months. Long time, bro. Bushy Long Dong. Thanks for 11 months. I've got to do it on the uh, loading. King Swami. He hates me now. We need another Ledex too. I really think we need to farm streets, but streets is like mad bully on us the other day. Uh, respirators for decontamination service. Can you get fuel conditioners just in til toolboxes? is Well, if I just wanted to get a survive, so do, but I literally have uh, maybe the light bulb we need. That's probably the only thing I can think of. Man, there's a scav all the way over there. Just a Todd slug to the thorax, even though I'm wearing armor. So frustrating. This is the other day all over again, I bet you. Four hours of just death. Now we have nothing. All right, we go again. Now we have no armor. Killer Princess, thanks for the uh, 11 months. Faye Shift, thanks for the 38 months. Fucked, thanks for the 43 months. <clears throat> Ned Flanders, thanks for 17 months. Hardcore is especially rough now that you can't get what like, consistently good armor. It's like any armor in the day when it said thorax, it covered the thorax. So therefore, if a scav shot you with a toz at like any range, you weren't going to get just a toz slug to the thorax and fall over. Now it's like. Even that last time was like a class four or five armor, but it didn't cover all the body. It's now like, meh. 
Oh, phase shift. That was a tier 3 sub for 38 months. Can we get some sloots up in the chat? For the tier 3 for 38 months. I'm glad, guys. I love seeing me get punished. I know exactly what you guys are thinking. What's a mayor? If I'm shooting someone from... Oh my god, there's three dead scabs down here. If I'm shooting someone from range, I want to use semi. Oh, sorry, uh, single fire. There's another. Hmm. Some slugs as backup, hey? We're not gonna make it out this raid, but we can dream, you know?
This guy took all the stuff of him. Oh. What the fuck? No! Fuck, fuck, fuck! What? I want to know where this guy's gun went. Should have gone and played under the helmets. We got so many scars for decontamination then that I'm not that too upset about it. Hey Pest, love the hardcore series this season. Also the video of you climbing I'm mountains you with it. your mates was really good and uplifting. If the scars kept coming, it's worth farming them. I was trying to find that guy. Like I imagine this that person died to a scav, and his gun was picked up by a scav. So I had to try and find which guy, or where the where it was. Can I just use this with AP20? I don't have any more respirators. Ugh. Just need to come up, you know? How do we go with that? I think it was like nine scams. Like going to do this stuff, it's all well and good, but we need to get interchange. We need to, we need the, the ram. We need to do the survives. We need to do chumming. No stress about quests today. Just do some casual raids and enjoy yourself. It's like, how do I word it? You, you you go into a raid with a with like an objective, but you like you just see where the raid takes you. That's kind of like how hardcore works. Otherwise, if if all I was gonna do, like if I wanted to stack up the hardcore account, I don't know how I'd do it. Probably I don't really want to go factory, but arguably you could just go factory and just like try and get a couple of kills or one kill and get out and just do that like four or five times after you get a collection of pistols. It's just sucky. Like, for example, then, we never heard that person even move. Like, and all of a sudden, I'm getting sprayed down. So, it's... When it's that situation, it's like, there's not really much you can do. If we're going to do anything today, we need to get those antique vases because it's 30,000 30, XP for just getting, like, three vases. I really want to try and get chumming done. Like I said, we got nine scav kills then for decontamination. That task alone is worth, like, 35,000 XP. All right. Here we go again. Might just run to the middle of the mall in this. 
And then hopefully I can just get one scav kill and I'll have a respirator. Well, maybe for this one, we just focus on getting um, uh, the books, for example, and surviving. Might be the play. I'll go straight upstairs, grab a book. I'll probably be tagged and cursed, if anything. Might be over quicker than we thought. Sound like a scav upstairs. That could have been a plow. Hello, sir. Why are you shooting at me? I'm just trying to get my book. Where's the scab? Respirator, nice. Hello? Go back this way to kill those scavs if I can. That's fair.
Okay. Get, um, cool. Don't think I want slugs. I suppose if we're desperate, hey? We have Emicon. I think we do. We do. <sighs> Couple of scav kills for decontamination and we're placing down this, so. It's good. It's good. Uh, I haven't got the solar installed yet, Bone Charm. My three-phase final gets installed. They ran into an issue and uh, they had to come back. So they're coming back next week. I think it is. 12th? I think the 12th they're coming back. So Monday next week. Is that someone there? I don't know. Probably gonna get me. It's depressing. The frustrating thing for me is I just don't. I don't even hear the player when they come out and just start shooting at me, you know? It's like, that guy just like, I saw the flashlight, but they were like already beaming ready for me. They heard me. I suppose I didn't have con uh, contacts on, did I? Go factory? Bro, I'm gonna be going factory with the PM pistol. Not even a full bag. Oh, I'm done. Now this will probably just be death, but we'll give it a go. Uh, burn charm, no dude. There is actually someone there. I feel confident there's someone there. No. Alright, here comes the scabs. I ain't passed. I ain't passed. Passed. I. What am I doing? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Shake it off. Oh my god. I can't believe I missed all that shit. <laughs> Best if you aim like that again, I swear. I'll leave. Well, I'm out of pistols now. I wasn't panic mag dumping though. I was taking my time shooting. I just, I don't know. I just didn't move the mouse. <laughs> time for the axe. My axe. Yeah, I'll give it a go. I just need, I just need a caffeinate, I think. After we wait three minutes to go back to the lobby, and then uh, three minutes to get in, we'll go in with just that melee weapon. Come on, this should, this part should not take this long. This is where I get more agitated than fucking dying. Well, this is the reason why I get agitated when I die. What the fuck? Paid actors in the game. Isn't there an achievement to kill like 20 PMCs with a melee weapon? Oh, there's two. Hit him! I killed the first one. I watched eight hardcore episodes on my fight back from Singapore, filled 14 hours nicely. Nice, thanks dude. Loading, come on. What the fuck is this bit? This isn't being this bad normally. Normally like you die, you press next a few times, you wait like five, 10 seconds, you're in. So I got the first scav. We got one more. Oh, is, they haven't fixed this yet? How stupid is this? All right, we just want a respirator and then we can...
Why? Just reset now. Actually, it's probably worth checking for the vase. Then. Wit can't, uh, can't thanks for the six months. with the pistol. We gotta go. Now we can try and place this down for hot delivery. We still don't have a respirator, but that's all right. There was a heap of fighting over the other side. I suppose I should just do this, hey? It's so slow. Born. But what I want to do, it's not the hot most worst spawn, it's it's okay. Could be better, definitely could be worse. Have you guys been finding gazelles in um, hidden stashes at all? Or weapon cases? They still spawn there. Stashes, yes.
Hello, good sir. Hello. Okay, Roaster, how you going, mate? Thanks for voting months. I don't like you only had a pistol. We need five kills for chumming. I reckon it's a scab to my right. Yeah, I don't care about that man. Oh, it was a player. Killed him. Fifty kilo. Fuck four.
Do I still have to place down one more helmet? I think I do. This cat's going to toss me in the thorax anyway. Oh my god. Don't, don't. He's laying down in the bush. SJ6 is going to run out. Hey, doing? I'm doing well, mate. I'm doing well. I got a gazelle placed down and two PMC kills. It's Rage already a dub. I was fighting in Goshen, so hopefully he doesn't see this. Uh, ben Erishion Games, thanks for two months. <clears throat> ben Sifty Cat, thanks for four months. Hey, pest. Watching the settings clip. Was watching your settings clip and notice we have the same monitor. It's an amazing monitor. Cheers, mate. I rate it. I rate it. First bullet, head face. Oh, GG. We got three PMCs though, so I'm happy. <sighs> three out of five for chumming. Man, that last guy must have been a kid, boy. If we get chumming done, which is a big if, but if we get chumming done, it leads to like, have a look at this, chumming. It leads to flint, dev talk bullshit, and no swiping. And like dev talk leads to house arrest. I don't know about the other ones. Bullshit has like uh, the suppressed, so flint's just that one. Dev talk's got house arrest and then house arrest part two. Bullshit's got silent caliber and no swiping. Which is that one? Oh, that's the, the new area of shoreline. But like all huge XPs. Not going for Caperon Hardcore. The current plan is to get the max traders, then I'll work on some guides while the YouTube catches up, and then once the YouTube catches up, I'll decide. All right, huge raid. Oh my god. We're gonna put bullets in their freaking heads. All right, this is gonna be a huge one. Even if we just get the scav, I'm happy. Scav, re respirator, and get out. I double tapped him in the head. Oh, 
So are you okay? Bullying a man with a pistol, I see. Yep, suck it. Now <laughs> weigh like four ton. The hardest part about that then is I um I forgot that I had to double tap V to get my melee weapon out because V is now vault, <laughs> and I'm like, why am I getting my melee weapon out? This if the whooping that PM sees us with only an axe. Fully dangerous thanks to forty seven months. I would uninstall after that. Would you? And my axe. All right, we're good. Should keep the shotgun for silent caliber. His armor is so slow and heavy, it's not good for, like, going to interchange with. This guy was shot in the head twice. Sir? Why did you shoot me? All right, we can go back to interchange. I don't think I'm going to take this armor into interchange. I might hold on to it for, um, we'll come back in the factory with it. Maybe I'll use, I'll use this setup for Silent Calibre. If, and when we get to it. This is Sellers, yeah. It worked well for us, <laughs> God. I shot him in the head. A lot. You axed him in the head too. I have coffee in the morning, tea in the afternoon. If I'm gonna drink caffeinated drinks. All right. We could go back to our lovely interchange. I just want some uh, 
be nice to have some brain work, some armor. What about if I go, I should have enough for a packer now. Nope. It's, this is just such a bad armor. Do you have any propane? Nope. Fuck. All right. Well, it's a good time for interchange, though. Good time. I still his name next wipe is going to be Gimli. Man's an axe. <laughs> Imagine try and get to, like, max traders for just using an axe. Whew. That would be fun. It would be painful, but it'd be fun. You'd get really good at it. I'm so freaking tired of family drama. Always the same, da same, same damn story. Then just don't get involved. There's a really good podcast. Um, and a lot of the thought processes that like I go through were the same as this guy. I can't remember the name of the, the guest, but it's Chris Williamson. And he's got, I'll show you, I'll, I'll, I'll let you know. Alex or Mozzie, 21 Brutal Life Lessons. I haven't finished the podcast because I'm like, I listen to it like when I'm doing stuff. This one, right? If you want to listen to a, a, an interesting podcast and how to get your head in the right mindset, that one's actually really good. Twenty one brutal, really honest lessons. The um, he talks about one of the things he says about drama was like, uh, and this is kind of how I see it, right? I just don't have time for drama. If you want to have drama, like good on you, like I'm out. Um, it's uh. He talks to that guy about it and he says old people have no drama in their life because they just don't have time for it. Like literally do not have time. They're going to die and they don't want to spend their time worrying about stupid shit. And that's kind of like me. Like obviously I'm, I'm not that old. I'm older. But like I just don't have time or care about someone bickering about some shit. If you have an argument with someone, like, yep, sorry, apologies, I fucked up, or you fucked up, whatever, move on. I just... A bit of lag there. Let's see if I can find a gold chain here to place. No gold chain. Nice. Actually, a really good one. Well, slugs are not as nice as I would have liked, but let's see if we can get some gold chains over here. When the reporter pistol we return. I don't know. Watch me find a Bitcoin and no gold chains. This game absolutely hates me. Motherfucker. Told you. I told you! Yeah, you can get them at the campsite too.
The only upsetting thing about this is um, it's a really good time to do chumming, but we'll hopefully, hopefully get back in nice and quick. But the scav kill plus touch in the body and all the loot should be making sure it's not a run through. <sighs> That's so typical. Literally so typical.